Okay. 10k, we've done it. Thanks, uh, Taxters, and good afternoon to this impromptu live stream. Well done for hitting the bell, like I always say. So you're here. Hopefully, the stream's all right. I'm lagging a bit. Um, should be okay. I'm a bit laggy on my screen, but yeah. Thanks again for 10k. Um, yeah, done it. Awesome. What do we do now? Hit 100k. That's what. Right. We'll hit it. Uh, yeah, just let me know if you can hear and see me okay. So I'm a bit laggy on my end, so I don't know if that's. Um, that looks alright. Yeah, let me know if you can hear and see me. I've got my assistants, the girls, and Amy's here. Sorting out some exciting stuff for Bamboo and beyond. So check that out. Um, sounds fine, all good. That's good, it's just my end then. I'll pause that, just so I know. Yeah, it's put me off. So yeah, uh, basically, I was supposed to do a boot sale today, but it's rained, and then I was gonna come back to unit and share some subscriber sales. So yeah, plus I hit 10K, so I thought, no boot sale, hit 10K, and subscriber sales, do it all in one sort of thing. So we're gonna pick some orders, which includes my recent plan for my recent video, uh, when I pick stuff up from the boot sale, I'll show you what I got on Instagram stories on my one links in the description. 24 hours, there's like a subscriber special sale. So, for example, uh, say, so this camera is worth 50. Like on eBay, I'll list it for eBay and list it on eBay for 50. Subscriber sale might be 30, 35. Just DM me straight to PayPal. I get a quick sale, you get a good deal. And that's worked. I got about four sales from that, which I'll share now. Um, thanks everyone, I can see everyone in the chat. Congratulations for the 10k, thank you. And thanks to Peter Ray, I'll quickly turn this round. Got a free gift from Peter Ray, the legend. It's a massive Jurassic World, obviously. Massive fan of Jurassic Park, Jurassic World and all that. So that's good, that's pimped out the unit a bit more. So, should we go on with some orders? In fact, we'll start with the Instagram orders. I need, you won't know, then a pair of football boots in here. This one, thank you. And there's a black pair of mics. It's the first pair that went uh, on Instagram. And that one, and then also some trainers, then pink or rose gold trainers. They're nice. They are nice, that's why they sold, I think. So yeah, like I said, Instagram stories, um, once you're interested, uh, just send me a message. And I'm just trying to find the name uh, on the spot now. Oh no, I can't find it. Oh, who bought these? <laughs> I can't find the name. Right, I'll find it in a minute. Basically, we've got the fillers. I owed, uh, what is it, £10 I bought for them. Got some Nikes, they owe me £2. And the 290s from the same sale. Black and red, they owed me three or four pounds. So all in, I'm in this at um, 16 pounds. Sold these all on Instagram, no fees apart from PayPal, 60 pounds, which is a good deal again for me and for the buyer. And I can't find the message, uh, which is annoying. I did have this, actually. Cricket stumps, that's okay, that's our pie. I'll do that in a minute. Um, I have to find, I get so many messages, it's hard to keep up. <laughs> Um, let's try and find it, try and find it. Right, no. Ben, there we go, found it. It was Ben, Ben Daly, Ben Daly. Thanks, Ben. Sorry, I forgot the name, I'm swamped with names. So Ben bought all three for 60, plus a bit of postage, of course. Yeah, uh, didn't have to do any listing, I've pictured them, but yeah, saves me listing, saves eBay fees, saves them lingering around. People get a good deal, so yeah, thanks again, Ben, for that. They're going out straight after this live. So hopefully with you, end of the week, maybe. Uh, we'll see how Hermes get on with that. That's up to them. And the other Instagram sale was from a good friend who was on the channel on Morning Reddies. And I'm just up here. Oops. If you did see the morning show I had, uh, I invited my good friend and my best man at my wedding, Joel, a fitness instructor. He bought the cricket stumps. Uh, I bought these for 10. He's bought them for 30. I'm going to drop them off hopefully on the weekend. Going to have a game of cricket. Uh, we grew up playing this game. So yeah, that'll be a bit of fun on Saturday. Should be good weather this weekend. And there's a jumble trail as well. We should be going to it at the same time. So that's cool. Um, yeah, again, 
Save, whoa, saves me listing, saves me posting, no fees. Gone to a good mate as well, and everyone's got a good deal. That was the aim. Quick, good deals, keep the stuff moving. Okay, next pair of trainers. Can you find this pair? They're white. Take the phone and try and find them. Why? Go into the comments. Don't want to ignore the people in the live chat now. 123 people in, so thank you. Uh, let's see if we've got any questions. Mr. Wise, hi George, first time catching you live. You've taught me a lot of your videos. Much love to you and your family. Uh, thanks Mr. Wise, appreciate that. Uh, got all the regulars in. Seeing, uh, pink coffee, we've had a sale. Live sale, we've got a badge. Again, if you wanna buy a badge, there's still a few left and getting through them all. Um, of course, if you buy, you get a free badge, so <laughs> either way. Uh, Twiggy Stoke, yeah. big fan George, been subbed since the very beginning. Have you found him? My assistants, my assistants, my assistants. I can't talk. Oh, another badge sale. <laughs> we'll come yeah, to that I was again. The in the so, this one, Son of Air Force. So, not quite Air Force One. They linger around, they're worth, not worth much. Uh, £15 these have gone for from a, uh, where are these from? From a charity shop. About three or four pounds from a charity shop. S listed since January. They're taking a while just to get £15. So yeah, not one to look out for, but if you can buy them cheap, why not? Pay them bills. So very shoe heavy at the minute. Right, next one, while I go back to the comments. Uh, let's do them football boots. They should be near the top, football boots in this one. No, they're not, they're in that one. Grey ones, nice thick football boots as well. And from the boots on Saturday, so a nice quick sale again. Um, hey Z, uh, congratulations 10k. Thanks Z, appreciate that. Uh, I think with 10k on YouTube, the difference is I can do YouTube stories, a bit like Instagram. So yeah, I might play with that. Uh, also, what else do you get? There's a couple of things you get with 10k subs. Oh, you found them, that's the ones. 80 pounds, that's right. So on Saturday's video, I made a few boo-boos. <laughs> uh, you can tell I'm half asleep. I had like four and a half, five hours sleep maximum. It was half five in the morning or six in the morning. I made a few mistakes. Uh, one of them was apparently, they asked 20 pounds or 25 pounds for three football boots. And I gave them 20 just for these. I'm pretty sure it was 25 each. Oh, I can't remember now. Uh, but yeah, I paid 20 anyway for the pair of Adidas Predators. And got an offer for uh, 80 pounds plus postage. Uh, listed them for 110, could have got a bit more, but quick sale, getting that money in, ready for the boot sales again. 20 to 80, nice, nice and easy to post, and more footwear. This is very easy to post out. Uh, with Adidas Predators, they come in different stages, there's like beginner, intermediate, and like expert. These are like the expert pro ones, so they're top end model, highly collectible. So yeah, keep an eye out for them. Uh, okay, next one. I think we just got badges now. I oh, know, uh, I'll get this. I oh, know, it's just here. Back when I had my wooden grass uh, photo background, uh, I used this stuff basically. Bought it from Home Base. Cost me like 25, 30 pounds. It's expensive stuff. Uh, obviously, I don't use that now. I use my retro squares and stuff. Uh, I had this laying around. Um, sold it for eight pounds plus postage, just for an off cut. There's quite a lot left. I didn't use that much. So yeah, money from nothing, that'll do me. Uh, if you do see it out and about, it's called Wall Pops. So if it is new, yeah, it's expensive to buy, so it'll be expensive to sell as well. So that's cool, instead of just chucking it in the bin, <laughs> or just donating it, I've got eight quid for it, that'll do me. Next one, uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, we've got clothing. Rest of clothing. Well, we'll see if there's anything else apart from clothing first. Or well, if I get this one. Or if you can find this one, it's in the bag, once it's loaded. Where, where is it? Clothing's over there, down there. I can think I can see it there, denim jacket. Let's go to some comments, any questions? Uh, someone thought she meant £25 for the free football boots. Um, I didn't at the time, and watching it back I don't think so. Um, I said would you take 20 for that, and she said unless you want to make a reasonable offer for all of them. So I'm guessing that would mean 25 each, if I want to make an offer on all of them. I oh, know, I just sold them for 80, so 
even if it was a mistake, I've still made a load of profit. That'll do me. Uh, is it Levi's? That's the one. Bit of clothing now. Uh, quite a heavy thing actually to sell in summer. We've got Levi Strauss Signature. So this is a very nice item. Would have probably kept this myself if it was my size. Uh, charity shop. Yeah, it's a slightly different Levi's badge. Paid £10 for this one, uh, accepted an offer at £30. It's not bad, it's better than lingering around till next winter and then trying to get 40 maybe. So I'd rather it go now, get a bit of profit, again easy post, which is handy, and out the door it goes. I'm pretty sure everyone knows Levi's is a good name to look out for in jeans. Right, next one for you two is another bit of clothing. And then we'll move on to some badges. Uh, can you find that one? Yep. It should be in this one somewhere. <laughs> Questions. <laughs> um, and the other mistake I made was on the speaker, it was in the thumbnail. I took it off and I thought the tweeter was missing, but apparently it was attached to the grill, which is, that's a new one for me, but no, they wanted a hundred quid for it anyway. Could have got maybe 200, but yeah. it's quite a lot. Oh, good one. Well, I was going to tell you a while. I need to know how much. Ten. My brain's not very good. Uh, 10 pounds. I think I paid, what did I pay for this one? We've got a West Ham polo shirt. Wash, oh, three pounds from a charity shop listed in March, just before the lockdown. So, not great. But uh, during the winter, obviously, and lockdown, uh, high-end items aren't freely available like they are at the moment. So that'll do. Three pound into ten. I've marked it down anyway. Get stuff moving. I want to make space for cool stuff instead of clothing. Clothing bores me after a while. <laughs> and I think there is one more sale. There's another low end sale. And then we'll get to some badge sales. Can you find a grey jumper? Only four pounds sale on the next one. But again, clearing <laughs> space. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, the reseller kids saw my Little Britain today for £23, paid £1.50 from cash converters. Another source of items. Uh, it might be in this one, jumpers, or the one the next bit. It's a grey one. Post reseller kid for 10 k um, The girls really do cry, thank you again. Uh, do you still get charged your £20 shop charge if you don't sell anything that month? Uh, yeah, if you've got a shop. You get charged every month, it's like a subscription, so make sure you're using it. Um, but if you're not using it, don't get a shop. There is just a shop with no payment, you have to pay per listing. Um, <laughs> child labour in force, yep. Yeah. I should think so too, they haven't had school for about three months, even though they are back half days now. <laughs> um, Mario Duran picked up a Super VHS uh, from Cash Generators for £10 comps at 120 to 150 yeah i sold one without a remote for 110 i was like this time last week when i went live actually that was a good one uh the dave remembers the early hundreds yeah when i first started i remember getting excited over a thousand can you find it struggling to find one this child labor is not working <laughs> it should just be a gray jumper Children can't find it. I bet I can find it straight away. Yeah. Show me it again. What is it? White stuff, lamb's wool. Is it this one? What size? Is that it? Extra It's this one, your Wally. That's Looks grey, but it's actually. <laughs> ah, that's right. You put the box back. I need that because I forget how much I pay. This is probably a fail, actually. Um, what do I pay? Two or three pounds, I didn't actually say how much. Charity shop, bought in March. White stuff, lamb's wool. So soft, again, March. The lockdown was lingering, so I was panic buying. Not something I'd usually buy, it just felt soft, felt like cashmere, so I gave it a go. But, um, what did I list it? It was listed at like 20, then 15, brought the price down. Someone offered me four pounds, I took it. I don't want to see this thing anymore. Clothing bores me, I want space. Four pounds, broke even. Get out the door. Nothing exciting there at all. Um, right, let's catch up with the chat. Do you have like a bag of badges? I have a, a oh, thing of badges. Right, it's badge time. Where is it? We've got some badges to say thanks for, and I've got some badges to put with it. In the drawer, the bottom drawer. No, no, no. In the middle. The grey one. No. 
that one, full of badges, and then the top one for envelopes. <laughs> Badge time, a message time. Can I have the one of envelopes as well? Who can I help? Uh, you can hold a badge. Oh, Just put it down there. I'll hold the envelopes. Hold it up. Got a single badge for Clive. Uh, I can't see if there's a message. So thanks Clive for the badge uh, on its way to you today. Put it down. And then put a envelope with it so I don't forget. Next up, we've got another single badge and we've got a note with this one. We've recently started reselling and been doing well because of you. We've learned a lot about vintage uh, retro electronics from you. It would be great if you could follow the business Instagram. Oh, I've done that earlier actually. Uh, as we try to hit a thousand followers at Spencer Sales eBay. Uh, thanks for the help and keep on killing it. We wish you and the family all the best from Harry and Yaz at Spencer Sales. So, yeah, uh, thanks Harry for that. And yeah, I did follow you earlier, so that'd be cool to keep an eye on. Um, next one, a couple more, another single one, 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 one. <laughs> George, a massive congrats for your well deserved 10k subs. Thank you. Uh, you're my favourite reselling channel. Thank you again. <laughs> Love your videos. It's such a massive inspiration to me and entertaining too. Missing the morning readies though, Ollie. Thanks, Ollie. Uh, yeah, morning readies should make a comeback, possibly. I don't know when, possibly. But I'm, I'm planning to bring it back for like a week at a time every now and then. So yeah, keep an eye on the channel, of course. That should be coming back. Uh, another single one. Oh, you hold it then. Hi George, been a long time subscriber and uh, well done on reaching 10k. Will probably attach my badge to my backpack when I'm out sourcing. Now that the car boots and charity shops have started to reopen here in Scotland. About time. Thanks again, Gordon. Thanks Gordon. Yeah, Scotland's finally opening up their charity shops. There are loads of comments on that, people in Scotland. I can't wait to get back to boot sales. Um, thankfully it's back on, just a shame about the rain. I think that was it actually for badges girls. Um, let's check Shopify because they're also my Shopify shop uh, orders. Uh, nope, I've done that. There we go, we've done it all. Yeah, I still need the badges though because I've had subscriber sales. We'll see if you buy, you get a free badge. Yeah. I would say there's a few left. There's still quite a lot left actually. There's still plenty to come. <laughs> if you are interested, link to the description, you'll get a shout out. I can't guarantee a shout out. I don't know how it will roll with video production and things. There you go. Reselling in progress. Also, if you see me out and about at boot sales or charity shops, and I've got my bag with me, I've kept a few in my bag so you can buy one off me if you want. I know a couple of people have, which is cool. Put them on your bag, put them on your bum bag. I'm rocking the bum bag. I think I'm, a few people rock bum bags. <laughs> but yeah, um, that's about it really. Just wanted to come on quickly, show you some sales, give the shout outs to the sales, let you know the Instagram thing went well. Ah, I remembered what else I was going to do. What? This one. Oh yeah, it's a very rare, expensive. You might have seen I listed a certain item yesterday for £495 and it was this bag. Um, I said I was going to show it off last week and yeah, I've gone with £495. Uh, basically, last Wednesday, it was at like a boot sale, five pounds. It was like a dealer as well. Um, that's why I was like the dealers, they get the cool stuff and they don't necessarily know everything, like this guy didn't. Uh, yeah, asked a five, they said the zip was broken, which it was, technically. Um, that's a Shopify sale. <laughs> um, I actually walked away from it for about 20 minutes, but came back, I just like the look of it. Uh, I fixed the zip within 20 minutes, 20 minutes, 20 seconds of being back at the car. It just needed to be like re-threaded. Um, it's got its shoulder thing as well inside. And apparently in 2005, this was to celebrate uh, Run DMC's trainer, the superstar trainer with Adidas. And only about a hundred were ever made in 2005. And this is one of them. Uh, it's basically a, like for vinyl LPs, Layla, you get that record. Do you know what that is? Do you know what a record is? Um, I know what it is, I don't know what uh, it is. The big square thing, yeah. This thing? Yeah. Is it the right one? It doesn't matter what one, I was just showing. <laughs> Basically, it's a big square bag. As I pull it out, nice and square in size, and it's for DJs. Get the 12 inches, and they can stack them up. Obviously, when I get to an event, scroll through, pick them out. Really cool item. 
Good album. Can you put it back, please? I will. Thank you. Oh, oh yeah, here's the strap. It's like a car belt strap. And there you go, Superstar. I don't know if it'll come out. So yeah, only 100 ever made in 2005. Apparently they sold out instantly. And I uh, oh, see, I'll just unhook the slip again, which I have to fix. Yeah. Shh. <laughs> um, what's I saying? You put me up there. <laughs> 2005, sold out instantly. Um, and doing some research, I could only ever find two or three others. One was on eBay about four years ago. They got £150. That was as an auction, that's why I don't do auctions. And then the other two, one was on a fashion resale site, they got $499. Um, so yeah, and none have ever been for sale since, that I could see anyway. So if you want to do a bit of research yourself, type in like Run DMC Adidas Superstar DJ case backpack. Yeah, so it's listed. Well, I say backpack, it hasn't actually got a backpack thing. It's a, it's a bag. Oh no, it's got a shoulder strap. Yeah, there you go. That's got, I got offered some, I got a message. Someone wanted to pay me to send it to them just to look at it and then send it back again. Dad, that was interesting. That's for the shoulder strap. You clip it on. I thought it was for that was cool. For sale now. It's got about. Uh, it's on about 50 watches already. I'm guessing that's viewers and stuff. But hopefully, should be an instant sale. Well, not instant, but a quick sale. I'm wearing them. If it sells within the first 30 days, it's only one pound for me to sell. Because eBay have run their promotion thing. Yeah, right. That'll do for now. I've got to get on wrapping this stuff. Thanks again for buying, everyone. Thanks again for the badge sales. Still plenty left. Keep going back now. Actually, no, I need them, don't I? My fault. Yeah, um, there is a Thursday boot sale in Essex. But it's supposed to rain, so I don't know if I will be out filming again tomorrow. But if not, Saturday's looking good for weather. So I should hit a boots out and a jumble trail. And then Sunday's looking good, we're going to do some selling. So yeah, look out for the channel, still more content to come. I'm not just stopping at 10k. I'm going to plough on from here and keep going. Hopefully we get a million. Hopefully we get a million and then we can have a plaque. I know, you get a plaque at 100,000, don't you? Yeah. I don't get a plaque for 10k. You could put it like on your desk or something. Yeah. Um... What else? Uh, shall I mention? I did mention... Well, no, I haven't mentioned, but I did put in the description. I just snuck it in. Uh, I get messages, people asking, like, with Peter Ray, sent me the poster. I'll show you again if you've just joined. Really cool. And I got gifted the Lego Dash Hounds as well. Uh, obviously, I don't ask for anything, but I get messages, people asking my address because they want to send me something or just a letter or something. Um, actually, there's another thing. This was another thing I got from a subscriber. I think I showed this on Morning Reddies. A vintage catalogue showing all that cool vintage hi-fi and TVs and speakers. That was cool. But if you did want to send a bit of like fan mail type thing, um, I want to decorate the unit a little bit. So if you want to send a postcard or something, I don't know. <laughs> just, if you want to send anything at all, or just a fan mail, a bit of letter or something. Um, yeah, the address. <laughs> the address is down below. It's just my unit address. Just put my name on it and I'll get it. I uh, might even make that a weekly thing. I do want to start a weekly show, so that could be a little segment, letters from fans or something. Don't know. But if you want to, the address is down below. And that's about me. So it's Peter Ray in the chat, is he? Oh, yeah, Peter Ray's in the chat. Cheers again, Peter. Appreciate that. It looks cool. It's massive though, so I had to fold it in at the sides. <laughs> right then. Let's wrap it up here. Thanks again, everyone. Uh, see you on the weekend. Goodbye.